Tribulus terrestris. Is it a powerful testosterone booster or is it just one giant supplement scam? In this video, I'm gonna give you the evidence-based truth about tribulus and its effect on testosterone levels in men. All right, so tribulus is an annual herb that's native to warm and tropical climates such as those of South Asia, South Africa, Australia, and parts of Europe as well. Traditionally, tribulus has been used in ancient Chinese medicine to treat cardiovascular disease and it has been used in ancient Indian herbal medicine to enhance aspects of male health. Today, it is perhaps the most popular and best-selling testosterone boosting ingredient on the market. Go on Amazon and search for testosterone booster and it's very likely that 90% of more of the search results that show up will have tribulus terrestris as a primary ingredient. But the question is, does it actually increase your testosterone levels? Well, in theory, it should. Tribulus contains a compound known as steroid saponins and this is a compound which is theorized that if uh, humans consume it then it should upregulate the production of LH which is luteinizing hormone which is a precursor for testosterone. But does this theory actually carry over into real life? Well, here's what the research has to say. So a group of elite rugby players was split into two groups. The first group got 450 milligrams of tribulus terrestris every single day for five weeks and the second group received placebo. At the end of five weeks, testosterone levels between the group that received tribulus and the group that did not receive tribulus were exactly the same. In other words, supplementing with tribulus failed to have an influence on their testosterone. In another study, healthy men were brought into a lab and split into three groups. So the men in the first group received 20 milligrams of tribulus per kg of body weight. Men in the second group received 10 milligrams of tri tribulus per kg of body weight. And the men in the third group received placebo and at the end of four weeks testosterone levels remained the same between men in each group and finally in this third study infertile men were given a twice daily dose of six grams of tribulus every single day for 60 days and at the end of this period all of these men experienced significant improvements in their sperm concentrations and a minor increase in testosterone levels in the range of about 16 to 17 percent so according to the research performed in humans and i want to emphasize that it is performed in humans and we're not talking about rat or animal or test tube studies here according to human research tribulus terrestris fails to have a significant impact on testosterone levels in men and even in infertile men the effect is very marginal all right not enough to actually experience any differences all right so why does tribulus then continue to be added to supplements and continue to sell like hot cakes well there are three reasons for this the first is that tribulus does in fact increase libido but uh, the thing that a lot of men don't understand which I go further into the video on the ultimate guide to testosterone boosters which I talk about below but basically the relationship between testosterone and libido does not go both ways. So what I mean by this is that although increasing your testosterone can increase your sex drive, increasing your sex drive does not necessarily impact your testosterone levels. So one of the reasons that so many men continue to supplement with tribulus is because they think it's working. They wake up with some raging morning wood and they just assume that their testosterone levels have increased as well. But as the research shows, that is most certainly not the case. And the second reason that Tribulus continues to sell is because it is scientifically proven to work. And I put that in quotes there because the research that brought Tribulus into the spotlight was actually performed in monkeys, rats, and rabbits. And even then, they were given intravenous forms of Tribulus, all right? It's not the same as popping pills of Tribulus because they were injected with it. And in that study, the rats and monkeys and what is it, rabbits actually did end up increasing their testosterone levels by 50%. I'll link out to all the research that was performed with Tribulus in my blog post below. But the bottom line is that although it seems to increase testosterone levels in monkeys, rabbits and rats, in humans, the same effect does not occur. And the third reason that Tribulus continues to sell is because it contains steroid saponins. And as I mentioned earlier, in theory, this compound should increase testosterone levels, but in practice, this is most certainly not the case. So does a tribulus actually have any benefits? Well, although tribulus's benefits don't impact 
athletic performance or testosterone levels, there are a couple of ways that tribulus can enhance the quality of your life. The first is that it actually improves markers of cardiovascular health. The second is that it might protect your organs, more particularly your kidneys and liver from oxidative stress. And the third is that it might help your body deal with the physical and chemical effects of stress. So yeah, although tribulus does not impact athletic performance or testosterone levels, there are a couple of health benefits. So yeah, in conclusion, don't fall for the hype, all right? If there's one thing I want you to take away from this video, it's that you should do your own research before taking any supplement. What they've written on the label or what you've heard is not scientific evidence for something that it's actually effective, all right? There's a difference between effectiveness and popularity. And even if something is scientifically proven to work, do your homework and check whether that science was actually performed in humans, how long of a time period that study actually took place, how many subjects were involved in it, etc. etc. All right? And I'll link out to my ultimate guide to testosterone boosters in the link in the description. And that's all for now. I hope that you have gotten value from this video. This has been Mo Salim from TripleUT.com, and I'll see you soon.